Hi, today I'm going to help you guys figure out how to send a video via email. So when you want somebody to see your videos, how do you send them out in your email service provider? So we're going to go through it kind of quickly. It's, it's seems a little complicated, but it's not, it's just a lot of steps. So here's my video. Say this is my video in YouTube. And so the first thing you have to do is upload your video somewhere. You can use YouTube or Wistia or um, what's the other one? I've forgotten, but those two work just fine. And when you upload it, you want to click on unlisted. That will keep your video um, separate from your other videos if you want to share them only through email. Or if you're doing a marketing promotion, of course, you would want to put it on public because you want lots of people to go there. So either way works just fine, but I usually do unlisted. You can't use private or no one can see it but you. So you upload the video and then you want to take a screenshot. And with a Mac, you do command, shift, and four. And did you see what just happened to my cursor there? It turned into this little thing like this. And you want to just hold it down and drag across to take a picture. Um, I did look it up for you PC people, and it says to take a screenshot, you click the window you want to capture, you press Alt and print screen at the same time, and it will print. Then, of course, you have to crop. So whatever program you use to crop, you can do this in Canva, actually. So once you have the picture, you go over here to Canva, and you want to click on Use Custom Dimensions. And usually it's about 640 by 480. And come over here and you see I've put my picture in here. Then you want to just find online somewhere one of these little icons that looks like this. Oops, I didn't get it. There you go. And now it kind of looks like, I'm going to make it a little bit bigger so you can see. It kind of looks like a, uh, uh, the screen that if you click it, it will, um, let me download this right here. If you click it, it's, it's going to play. And the reason you want to do that, you're not actually going to put the video in the email. Unfortunately, that's not possible, but, um, you can see that I've actually done it over here. So I downloaded and then you come over here. Oops. I'm going to cancel that for now. And I'm in my email. This is one that I had done for another time. And this is actually the, the freeze frame on that picture. Um, of course, when I was doing the picture for the, the video in YouTube, I kind of fast forwarded it until I found one where I was smiling a little bit. Let me show you that. See, <laughs> that took probably the longest time of anything. So we come over here to email and you will just put an image block in, however that works on your um, deal and then you pull in this image and it looks like doesn't it look like and up here it says please play the video so they're going to click on that but what you want to do when they click on it is you come over here right here and you click on share and that will give you this link and I want to copy this link and I'm going to put it over here and so you click on this picture and there's the link right there see that blue thing that looks like a link of a chain. So click on there and you see it's already got one, but I'll just put it in this one instead. And you just put it in there and there's the YouTube link and you say, okay. So now when you send this email out to people, you can say, play this video and they click on the picture <clears throat> and this would open up. And actually, you know, you might have this loaded onto a page in your email. I mean, on your website, um, and in that case, you would put that link in to that website page. All right, so does that make sense? That's how you put a video in an email. Of course, you could just put this link in and have them click that, but they are much more likely to click on a picture with that little play sim symbol because that's what we're used to doing. Okay, all right. Any more questions, let me know.